Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Hopefully you can't hear Sash snoring. Um, if you do, I apologise. Um, so I thought I'd show you what I got from um, Disney and Universal. So I got two big bags. As you would have known, I have not long got back from Disney, uh, Disney World, Florida. I have put up some vlogs, so if you've not seen them, please go and check them out. Um, that would mean the world to me. Um, and if you already have, thank you so much. So I'm just gonna dive in. So both bags have mixed Universal and Disney in. So first thing I'm gonna show you all was obviously the 50th anniversary bag. So you've got um, Mickey and Minnie and the castle there. And then on this side, you've just got the big 50th and the castle inside the 50th. Um, inside the 50th, inside the, the zero to make the 50th. So I picked that bag up and then obviously when I went to Universal, I picked the Harry Potter bag up. So it's just this one here. And that's what the back looks like. It just looks exactly the same. So I'm just going to dive into both bags. They will be a mixture because I didn't pack them properly. Oh, let me show you this. So this might be a bit hard because you are attached. But I picked up a new camera strap. Um, so hopefully, oh, that might be upside down for you. But it's just this like video tape <clears throat> video roll um with all the different oh sorry disney characters on um and then obviously there's more this end but i don't know if i can actually show you these ones are upside down so um yeah so i just picked that up from our actual hotel um i was in in need of a new camera strap so i just picked that up and um, I love it, it's amazing. It was difficult to put it on, I'm not gonna lie, the the difficulty we had with that, but it's on now, so now I'm not taking it off. <laughs> so I got that and I love that. Um, so let me start in this 50th bag. We have, oh, let me show you these. So. This, this is the um, soaps that were in our hotel. So this one is in from the Universal Hotel. It was the um, soap that we had in there, and that was in the Cabana. I can't remember the rest of the name of the hotel, but the Cabana Hotel. Um, in Universal and then I just picked up the hand soap um, <clears throat> oh excuse me from our hotel in the pop century in Disney so if you go to Disney did you even go to Disney if you didn't take home their soap you know if you know you know so the next thing um, I got, well I didn't actually get this, Megan got me this for my birthday, was when we was in um, Universal, she picked me up a little E.T. plushie, how cute is he? And he's now escaping. <laughs> um, so yeah, she just picked me up this um, plushie of E.T. because E.T. is my favourite and E.T. was my favourite ride. In Universal because I love E.T. so much so I've got a little E.T. oh this one this one wasn't from Disney but Megan also picked me up this this was from I think she got this from AliExpress um, before we we came and it's a little alien dressed as Buzz little handbag and how cute is he? Um, but this was not 
from Disney. This is just what I carried home in my bag. So, when you, when we, oh, that's it, Cabana Bay. So, when we were seeing Universal and Disney, we got the refillable mugs just because it's a lot easier and it's really good to have as a little keepsake as well. So, this is the one I got from Universal. So, it just says our hotel name on it, Cabana Bay. And it's just like a little beach theme going on there. And then it's got this little pulley up lid and you sit from it there. Um, and these are great to just reuse at home as well. So got that one. And then obviously when I was in Disney, I had to get the 50th Disney one. So this is the one I picked up. There was, there was two types of these. Um, and there was two types of the, of the Universal one as well. But I just really like this one. Megan got the other one, as you would have seen in the other vlogs. Because um, she liked that one. It's just got a sippy lid here. Um, I really like to just keep those. Um, and then, next things. Okay, so you would have seen that in... Well, you may not have seen... If you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that we got the um, little wishables. So I got the um, Muppets one and then I also got the 50th one. So this is the little Muppets one. So I got little fuzzy bear inside. I mean, why does Disney have like these really really long labels i don't know they're they're on everything so i've got fuzzy bear in the tight in the muppets wishable and then i'm not sure don't hate me i'm not sure whether this is chip or dow um but i got a little 50th one of chip or dow because i don't know who's who because i can never tell them apart um but how cute are they guys how freaking cute are they? Too cute. And then... I've got a little daisy, daisy duck, for um, a little... My little bestie, Ruby. Um, she's, she's a bubba. Um, she's, my best blah, 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 blah. she's my best friend's baby, so i got a little daisy. Little Daisy. And then, then we go. Right. This is okay. I'll do them ones after. Cause they are this bag here, guys. Is all pins. My bad. My bad. Um, so, I also picked up these little earrings. How cute are they? So I picked up them ones, and I also picked up... Oh, these are not on the thing because I've been wearing them. Um, but let me just show you one of them. The birthstone Mickey ones. Is it going to focus? Please focus. These focus. It's the oh they are there they are. It's the birthstone Mickey ones. Um little study rings. So I picked those up because I love those. And then let me see if I can get in these. Oh these are not oh yes they are. I see these and if you know me you know I love up anything up. So when I see these I had to get them. Oh Oh, they're just these little up earrings. How cool are those? So I picked those up. I just thought they'd be fun to wear, and I wore them um, when we went to um, Ohana's for dinner. I think I wore them when I went to Ohana's for dinner. I don't know. You would have seen in the vlogs. Um, so I got those. I'm thinking I'm supposed to be having a bag. Oh. Okay. 
so of course i had to pick up a new magic badge it wasn't all i wanted there was limited on the stock of magic bands that they did have as you would have seen in the vlogs if you watched them um we went everywhere and we couldn't get them so i i wanted the up one that i had seen for ages and it just was not there so i ended up picking up this Pooh bear one is that upside down no yes <coughs> so you just cut out there i don't know why but um, yes, so I was just saying I picked up this Pooh Bear Magic Band. So you, if you've not been to Disney, you need Magic Band to get into your room. You've got your park ticket on there. You can also have your um, like wallet on there, so you just tap and go. Um, it's so much easier just to have Magic Band. Or you would get given a card. I'd lose a card, so... Um, Megan looked after this one. This was for the Universal one. This was our um, room key. Um, and it's just the Simpsons, if you can see that. It's just the Simpsons. Um, so this, this was our um, room key. And then I also, obviously it was my birthday when I was out there. So I got a birthday badge mm. and then I don't know if I showed you I think it was in my packing video but I wanted to fill up my coin my press coin collection and I finally filled them up and I'm actually super duper proud I managed to fill them up guys so you just I don't know if it, whether it'll pick it up but like they're just all in like pressed pennies with the characters on so I managed to fill that up I'm so pleased I managed to get that filled up okay then I'm gonna move on to your bag and I'm gonna come back to that bag and do the um what's it's afterwards when we went to our harness for dinner we got a little flower garland and then in Universal I told you I love ET. I picked up the ET top, so it's just the basically ET logo on a t-shirt. So I love that. Picked that up. Wore that straight away. You would have seen that in the vlog. And then in Animal Kingdom, I picked up this Safari Mickey. What does it say? Oh, it just says Walt Disney World. So, yeah, I picked this up from Animal Kingdom. They had loads of these. They had Spirit Jersey that matched. So tempted. I was like, no, no, no. And then, when we went to Typhoon Lagoon, we picked up, with me and Megan both picked up the Roxy, like, water spirit jersey kind of thing. I don't know what these are called, guys. Um, just to protect us a bit from the sun, because it was hot. So, this is what it looks like. And it's just got Roxy down the side. And mine's just a long sleeve one. Megan got the short sleeves. So we picked that up. I also had to pick a towel up. Because I knew I wanted to get a towel from Typhoon Lagoon. So I just didn't bother packing one. So we definitely need to pick a towel up straight away. So if I can. Just the right way? I don't know. So I just got this. You see that? And it's a stitch towel. Hopefully you guys can see that. And then at the bottom it just says Typhoon Lagoon. So I picked that up, which I loved. Well, I still do love it. I said like I loved like I'd got rid of it kind of thing. Not stuck love it no more. So and then the next thing I picked up was this fan this wicked magnificent fan love that and then I've just noticed over here not very well packed guys but so I picked this up from the um, Japan Pavilion in Epcot so when I went in I think it was like 2018 or 
whenever I went before. I picked this one up, a little fan, but on the back they write your name. Um, and then this time I got this version, but they've not started bringing back the um, the cast members from the countries, different countries. So they wasn't there to write my name on, which it's okay, like it's not a big deal. But I will say it kind of, it didn't feel the same. I know it's not going to feel the same because of COVID and everything, but the the magic of going to the different pavilions and having somebody there from that country um, was amazing before. Um, but this time it, it was okay, but that kind of magic had been taken away kind of thing. Um, but nevertheless, I still got... Oh, this one's actually a bigger one, I didn't realise. I still got one of these. I want to do like a collection and stick them on my wall like maybe like that or something on my wall and then have some more i don't know is that weird i don't know but yeah that's what i want to do and then that's everything in that back right on to oh i'll just mention this this is not disney well i got it in the airport they had a frigging kylie jenner vending machine in the airport what why don't we have them over here like so if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that I used the Kylie Magenta vending machine to get a, um, excuse me, lip set, and I got Christian. Is the name of the colour that you're probably not gonna focus on because my head's in the way. There you go. Um, so I picked this one up from the airport from a vending machine. How crazy is that? Okay. On to the pins. <laughs> so I did go a little bit cray cray, not gonna lie. Um, but let's just, I'll explain as we go. So it was my birthday when we was out there. So of course I had to get the birthday, you're gonna, the birthday um, pin. So I picked this one up. I don't know how much prices that these ones are or anything really because they have the the like the the yellow the green the mint you know you being you get me so okay so this is one of the mystery packs that um i got so i got this one for my cousin katie and these are the different pins you can get um so I picked this one up for her, so I've not opened that one because it's hers. And then I got two sets when I was out there. And if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen me open these. Mm -hmm. So this is my box. And let me show you the pins I got because I couldn't wait to open them, so I already opened them. So we've got... Oh my god, they're falling away. Mm -hmm. They're running away. Shh! So i got a Russell. So I've just got Russell. I got a young Carl. Oh, I got an Ellie. And then the one I wanted the most, um, because this one reminds me of my grandpa who passed away, but me and my cousin Katie, when we watched the film, he walks like, he, like, everything about the character reminds us of my, of our granddad. So I really wanted Carl. Oh, please focus, there you go. And I got Carl. Like, how amazing was that, like? So we picked them, I picked those up, I got those, oh my God. Carl's disappeared now, he's run away. Um, I'll put that up in a minute. Oh, I got a little Pluto pen <laughs> because why not? Got that one. Oh, I got the Coco mystery pack. I told you guys I went crazy on the um, 
the pins. So we got this guy. I don't know, I can't remember his name at the, at the thing, at the, um, at the program, program, mm. film, program, not watching any standards name. Um, and then, oh my god, this one's quite hard to, to hold because he's quite, can you see that? Yeah, I think so. So yeah, I've got the, those ones. And then I've got another mystery set of the like the what was, these are like the safari ones. So I got them ones, and then they are the so those are the ones that you can get. So I got the two that I wanted. So I just got this one here. And then this one here. So I've got those two. Okay. Now I promise you there is no more no more mystery bags. So the story behind this one is my nan used to collect thimbles, so I started um, when she passed out of now I've got some of her thimbles and I started collecting thimbles so when I went to Disneyland Paris I got the, thim the thimble I don't know if I can show you oh yeah here look I got ooh I just need to tell I got this thimble here and as you turn it it says Paris on it and so I wanted the Florida version, which they did have a couple of months before I left, because a couple, uh, couple of months before I went. But then when I went this time, I couldn't find it anywhere. So they had a pin version, so I just picked up the pin version instead. So technically, I still kind of got a thimble, but I got a pin instead. So I picked that up. Then picked up the Everest. Um, the Everest pin and this oh he moved <laughs> I quite like the moving ones um, so I picked that one up oh I picked this one up in the outlets because I thought he was super duper cute so I picked him up I then I couldn't go to Universal and not get a Universal pin, so I picked this one up. Oh, actually, I've got a t-shirt that I don't think I showed you because it's in the wash. So just imagine, because I have been wearing it, um, you would have seen it in the vlogs if you watched the vlogs. Um, but it's this, it's this pin, this exact pin, I don't think the camera's picking that up very well, but it's this exact pin in a t-shirt form. But I've I've worn it to death and it's in the wash. Um, so obviously I couldn't go and not get a pin of our hotel. So I got the Pop Century pin. There we go. Um, to commemorate being there. I then also got. We didn't go to Blizzard Beach because Blizzard Beach was closed. But when we went last time, Blizzard Beach was my favourite water park out of the two. So I just picked up a Blizzard Beach pin. Oh. So I love this pin. So I picked up the Mickey and Donald in the... Can you see that? in the Dapper Dan's outfits um, looking super cute so I picked that one up then obviously it was the 50th so I had to pick the 50th pin up so I picked up the Mickey and a mini 50th then I picked up the Skyliner pin because it was my first time on the Skyliner because when I went before they were just building them um, and this time was my first time on there, so I picked that one up. 
then obviously peach supper cocoa pin because if you know me you know i love skulls and skeletons and coco is one of my favorite films alongside um i don't know what i'm saying guys okay there we go we tip them ones out and then i got this one love this ride so this is from the mickey and minnie's runaway run runaway railway i should always struggle to say that um but look at this one you can ready Yee! i really like that one so i picked that one up and then picked up an ursula pin because why not because she's like my favorite villain just look at her so i picked that one up oh picked this one's got a little bit wonky on there picked the uh typhoon lagoon pin up because obviously we was at typhoon lagoon so i picked that one up dropping this one so i picked this one up um because i actually had a cocker spaniel called lily but unfortunately she passed away from cancer bless her but when we stayed at our pop century hotel we have stayed at the 50s section and outside the 50s section was a lady and then just opposite was tramp so i had to get this pin so I had to get the lady and the tramp pin um, and lady here looks exactly like Lily used to but Lily was black and grey instead of like a instead of two browns <laughs> and then oh look here this is the other 50th pin I got so of course if you know me you know I love dogs so I had to get the the, the uh, Pluto and Goofy one and then I got this one mainly because my granddad loved trains and this is the Hogwarts Express so I had to get the Hogwarts Express so I got that one and then this is the one this one isn't for me this one I picked up for my best friend Charlotte um, as she has just got married well I say just got married we're now in june she got married in april um but i see this and i was like oh my god i love it so i picked her up the bride and groom pin which she probably would have had if i had gone the first time this holiday was booked but because we obviously had to rebook like 700 times okay there's an exaggeration but because we had to rebook like four times um she's now getting it late because i would have picked this up if i'd seen it i would have picked this up prior to her wedding but it's i think it's still a nice gift to give her now that she's a brother now that she's a wife sorry about that did you hear her like really snore um so yes i picked this up to give her um and that i believe oh, is everything that i picked up i hope you have enjoyed and i will see you guys in my next video so i didn't show you everything guys i forgot the main things that i went, that i actually went for so i actually as i as you know i love kevin ignore my new rain jacket in the back it's from sainsbury's not sponsored um but i got the kevin backpack and if you would see in my vlog You'd see I'd been looking everywhere for this and the second to last day, bam, they restocked him. So I had to pick the Kevin backpack up. So obviously it's just a backpack like that. I picked that up. Then, oh, dodgy angle. Then you would have also seen that in my vlog, I was looking for the Kevin backpack, but didn't see that. But I found this one you know me you know i love bars so i picked up the buzz bag um i wasn't going to get two i was only going to get one and i was just i set my heart on getting the kevin bag but then i see this one because i thought i wasn't going to get kevin and then the kevin was restocked so i was like i have to get both but this one i thought they'd have gone out and they weren't bringing it back 
but it was there in Hollywood Studios. Um, so yeah, I picked this one up at Hollywood Studios and the Kevin backpack, you would have thought would have been in Animal Kingdom, but it wasn't. I ended up picking it up at um, World with Disney in Disney Springs. Sorry, she's now cleaning her feet, being annoying. <laughs> dogs um so yes i promise that is now everything guys i hope you have enjoyed and i will definitely see you in my next video bye